Hello. Uh, welcome to round. I don't know. It's not whatever. Uh, I have kept seven. I kept six. And you're on the play. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, we will play a brain pool tap to pass. Gonna flip a pathway. Mm -hmm. Play Mystic. Go ahead. Uh, land and then feel bad. Faster. That does feel bad. Gonna play Pathway? And a Priest. Yep. Go ahead. Uh, I will foretell a card and Pastor. I get a sign. Oh, okay. Tap, sacrifice these two. Yep. To do uh, a bunch of well, stuff. Is it, it's not a creature yet. Correct? Yeah, it, I mean, it's, it's a creature. Is it a creature? Oh, okay, it's okay. I thought you, sorry, you, the way you placed it, I thought it was an enchantment. No, sorry. No, you're good. It's sorry. a 1 1 creature. So, you lose to life and sacrifice a creature. Okay. I get two black mana and draw a card. And then when a creature dies, she flips. Okay. When she flips, she turns into Liliana the Cranky and gets a zombie friend who's her yep. brother. When my blister pod died, I got a scion. Yep. Sort of forward in front here. It's red. I'm gonna sacrifice the scion for Anna. Um, and yep. And use a two black to cast a low strider. Okay. Which has a goat friend. Yep. Then I'm gonna plus two so that we both discard a card. Thanks, gonna go. Go ahead. Hold the multiverse? Yep. Cause multiverse doing. I mean, it at least showed me that I would have hit lands, but at this point, this is over, so. I'm turn four in a ramp deck with two lands. Yeah. I I top deck two stompers on two lands. That wasn't going to do it. No. I think I flipped Liliana more times today than I flipped Gideon on my human's deck. To be fair, you have to play Gideon in your human's deck first. Yes. I only have one Liliana here. Yeah, but she's being the main face. I feel like Gideon never shows up. He, he does show up, but... It's just um, always in a... I'm here. Yeah. I'm like big... I have no brains. I just beat people up. He, he tends to be a little more... Like, win more or like just gas more. Yeah. Like, you end up having a turn where you're like, okay, flip Gideon. And I just see so many more cards in this deck. Which is not nothing. Well, I mean, just being able to sack and draw is pretty helpful. Yeah. That's true. I should probably look at the sideboard. You actually do have things that I can sideboard against. I didn't watch the game. I just watched the highlights. I forgot it was even on, to be it's honest. A good game. And the old, my my real only takeaway, well, two takeaways, right? But the, the big one is, who does that? Who on their first drive in the season? It was not, the second drive. Was it the second? It was the second. Okay, sorry. I was watching the highlights, so I skipped through a lot. So I thought it was the first drive. So either your, your first quarter of the of the, in your, the season. On your own seventeen. On your own seventeen. Fourth down, away, and you go for it. Yep, that's Dan Campbell, everybody. I mean, good for them. It worked out real well. Um, Motor City Kitties go meow. But uh, the 
Other thing I took away from that game is receivers can't catch. No. Yeah, I, I, said, I was watching the highlights, and there were so many missed catches off the hands. The interception off the guy's face. That was funny. It wasn't on Pat Mahomes. It's going to go as a, as a pick six for Pat Mahomes. It wasn't his fault. Yeah, no, no. That's, those are the ones that always feel bad for a quarterback. You're like, oh, cool. They're, that was that was literally the best I could have thrown it to you. It couldn't have been any, been any better, and you would have hit you in the face. In baseball, uh, something being called an error is a judgment call of the scorekeeper. Yeah. I feel like in situations like that, there should it be should a, be the scorekeeper's job or whatever the equivalent is in football to call that a fumble. I mean, if because they, that's on the player. It's if they ins- not. if they instead counted like dropped passes, and a dropped pass isn't counted as an interception against the or quarterback, a if drop it's pass dropped. that turns into an interception, yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, 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 that works too. Uh, I don't know if I said, but I'll be on the play again. We'll Sounds see good. if this one game goes a little longer than the last one. Probably. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Are you kidding me? Can't keep either. It's not a terrible hand. Just yeah. it's no. I'm a ramp deck with no ramp in hand. I'm only playing four bullets of citadels. I hope. I hope you're not playing anymore. That might be a little bit of a problem. I mean, I feel like that'd be beneficial for my opponent. Maybe it depends on how much you can just go off with it. The second bullets of citadel is significantly worse than the first bullets. Sure, but if you like guaranteed to have one, you're always going to have one on turn five or four, whatever the curve is for that. Then. It does really. It could really help you if if it if it truly enables you to go off. If it if it's borderline way more than maybe not. It depends on which life I have. If I can get it on the battlefield with yeah, more than life fifteen game. life, oh, yeah. I've won the game. Okay, it's not a question. And then I'm gonna kill myself. I don't actually. Most of the games I win will not have a boss of Citadel because I don't need it to win. But it, it certainly helps. I went on the blaze of glory. I was about to be like, oh yeah, we're good, we're good to go. We just shuffle up my way. No, we both just mold. Yeah. It's about as good as I can do without hitting something actual. Or bad. That's upside down. Oh, that means my other side work comes. I will keep to I will put this to the bottom. I will keep as well and put... Mm, hey, Siri, which of these are bad? The left one. The left one's my only thing. Oh. <laughs> then why are you asking if it's bad? <laughs> or you guys about the whole seven? Yeah. Third from the right. No, I'm not doing that. I'm sorry. I'll do second from the right. Third from the right, I actually kind of need. It's like getting a blind boss, he's almost. Kind of is. Ready? Yep. All right. Uh, I will go with Nykthos. Pass. That's pretty good. Not entirely what I want to do turn one. Yeah. Howie. Mystic. Yeah. Uh, drop a turn. Land for turn. Okay. I will tap two and I will foretell a card. And I'll pass turn. I have to. Yeah. Dylan gave me the best out of three, but in game two. Yeah. Combat's one. I take one. Play goose. Of the Gilded Brain. Okay. Draw. Cool. This one at least still feels good. I uh, will play a Dreamer Cascade. Untap to control two or more of them. Yep. A three. Play a Rejuvenator. And hope we don't whiff. Good block. Almost whiffed. Would you like to randomize? I am not worried about it. To the bottom they go. Pass the turn. Cool. Well, I think I need to try to do this this way, though. We 
we are going to, well, the colors don't matter, so, pay two. Mm -hmm. And we are going to behold the multiverse. Jeez. And we are going to scrape two. How's multiverse looking? Uh, currently foggy. Just putting those both at the bottom, and we'll draw two. Hopefully it looks better. Oh, Jesus. That's not the sound someone makes when the multiverse looks better. Yeah. Seiju is land for turn. Yep. To get a blocker on the field. Feels bad. Feels bad. Um, and I will pass her. Place the path Mm-hmm. Can you go to combat? Yeah. Swing for three. I'm gonna put blocks there. Can you get him? Uh, and then for damage, four damage, I'm gonna pay two. I'm gonna cosmic hunger, and I'm gonna make him punch him. In response. Yeah. Tap kill the goose. Yep. Sacrificing food. Yep. When I sacrifice a permanent, I deal one damage to any target. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Throughout that, that, you can uh, do that in speed, so yep. Yeah. yeah. Alright. And then fizzle the mana. But no yeah. damage, though. Just, yeah, fizzle the damage, so. Sega main. Mandible. Yeah. Go ahead. Land of return. Solve the equation. Yes. What is the answer? That is the question. No, that's that. That's not. It's not the equation. It's the question. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, we're solving the equation. Um, it's either honestly, it's going to be this or this. In all honesty, but let's yeah. just double check. I, Come I mean, on, I want seventeen forest triads on the battlefield. I hope they can go that big. Oh, Jesus, this. Is, we're gonna go with an awakened voice. Oh, you got the. Do you always have the floor version? Yeah, no, I went with, with and we throw, I'm like, you know what? No, splitter jump, go to the floor. That's it why I went with Mystic instead of Lanor Elves, because the Mystic has cooler. The, so my problem is, I have so many of them, um, all of the elves already, that there's no reason for me to go get more. Right. I didn't get any of the Lord of the Rings side. So, so. Is that where that one came from? Yeah, yeah so this yeah. came from Lord of the Rings Commander set. Yeah. I actually have the Lord of the Rings version, a. Promo version and the pre release version that I got at the pre release. Yep. That's fine. So, I've never actually able to use one of those for anything, so now I do. Uh, and I, I will pass her. On tap. On tap. Draw. That's a 0 3. Yeah. He's just a lovely little 0 3. Super sad. Eat one of them. No, 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 no. Or get eaten by yeah. one of them. You take four. Yep. Go to 15. Second main. Yep. Go ahead. Oh, my lands. Scary. Um, okay. That was the okay of like, I'm not terrified of this thing. Just it's just a weird feeling. Uh, X of four. Wait, the woods. Um, yep. I'm waiting for you also to be like, deal them all one damage. And then I will pass her. And in your turn, I'm going to use Gilded Goose to create a food. Yeah. And yeah, my issue when I was going through my deck with all like my Tatio was all my all my cards were basically paired up with yeah. duplicates. That makes sense. In the middle of the deck. How many cards do you have in hand? Three. No, he's a one. One top of the set, so it's just plus one plus oh. Oh, gotcha. So, Go to but combat? you take a damage to the head. Sure. 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 And I pass. I, I will. 
I'll throw a, a dryad in front of one. So I'll have one going blocked. Okay. And you take three. Three. Or twelve. So you main phase? Mm-hmm. Mr. Pot? Yeah. Terrified for the moment you get an outlet. Okay. Uh, Who needs an outlet? It's not the point. I'm just gonna beat you up with my with my angry little devils, because that's what they're good for. Yeah, Six. Seven. Tapping for seven. Seven. Yep. Tyrannix Rex. Who are you? You a big boy. Yeah. Eight eight, can't be countered, trample, ward four, haste, toxic four. Oh. Yeah, he's chunky. Yeah. So the question though is, is how big of a deal is it if I attack you versus making you try to attack me? Oh, it's not a great card. I mean, but, the trample really makes me have the winning side in this race, I think. So I'm gonna go to combat and I'm gonna swing. Eight. Take trample. Yeah, I'll take the eight. Okay. And the full poison. Yeah, four times. If I kill you with toxic, yeah. we're in a really weird game. And then I'll pass her. The end of your turn. Yeah. yeah. Tap two. Sacrifice yep. of food to gain three life. Mm -hmm. Also shoot with the dryads with a gun. Thirteen. And then I'm tap two. Tap the ghost. Create a food. Yeah. Foods, sacrifice it. Yep. Gain three you, and shoot you for two. Okay. And tap the other food, sacrifice it, gain three, shoot yep. you for two. Sounds good. Sounds good. Yeah, yeah I just getting out of a hole first. Uh, I was holding I, on to this in case you got too fun. I top decked a second awake in the woods. And so then I, it was at that point that I realized I did make the mistake. I should have grabbed the awakening because I would have had an 8 8 and a 9 9 next to each other and it would have been a much bigger threat for your board. That would have been very big threat. The fact that I have hit all of one Tati over tonight has been very annoying. Is that the match? Yeah. 2-0 him. 